Hello, it's Monday, and I'm sick as a dog. Can there be, like... Okay, it's fandom week. It's fandom week. Like, things we are a big fan of. Can I be a fan of Halls? Because they're, like, my best friend. <laughs> anyway, my fandoms... Well, actually, I've got a couple failed fandoms right here. I attempted to get into the Supernatural fandom, and I sort of got in, but it's just there's like seven or eight seasons that I'm... I'm ugh. This is the third season, borrowed from my friend, and I just had to stop watching it. There are 22 episodes in every single season, and it's, I couldn't. I mean, I liked the first two seasons, and I liked what I watched in the third season. I just don't have the time to be obsessed with it. Um, and then... My friend Erin, she's Thursday, right? Yeah. She gave me John Green's Will Grayson, Will Grayson. And I never really got into that either. It's weird. Um, but actual fandoms I'm part of. I'm definitely part of the Hunger Games fandom. Which I think I qualify as being part of, even though I haven't read Mockingjay yet. That's this baby right here. I don't need to. But, um, I mean, I'm obsessed with the Hunger Games. My Tumblr is kind of filled with it. And also, One Direction. And, um, I would show you something related to One Direction, but the only stuff is on my iPod, and that's what I'm using to film with. But, I've listened to the entire album by One Direction probably every single day since I bought it like a month ago. YOLO? I don't know. Um, and I, I have phases in my life where I'll be obsessed with like one video game, one type of music, and one television show at the same time. So over this past summer it was Doctor Who in which I went on a month-long marathon where I just watched every single episode of the new series of Doctor Who. I'm just obsessed. I love Doctor Who so much. And then, also, I listen to nothing but Coldplay, and I now know pretty much every single song by Coldplay. And, um, wait, what did I say? TV show, band... What was the other thing? I don't know, but also I'm obsessed with a play called Next to Normal, which is very relevant to my family because it's about a family that's been torn apart by the death of a child, and that happened in my family before I was born, and we're still dealing with the repercussions, just like the family in Next to Normal. It's very interesting. So I've always connected to that, and I just absolutely love the play, and the music, and yeah. Um, oh, I've always been obsessed. My DS is in my car, but I've always been obsessed with Pokemon. I have to show something related to Pokemon, because it's not that hard to find something related to Pokemon in my room, because I'm crazy about Pokemon. See here? There is Pokemon White. Oh wait, no, that's that's Pokemon Soul Silver. And here is Pokemon White. Oh, and Pokemon Platinum. So yeah, obsessed with Pokemon, that's me. Um and Fire Emblem. Now, Fire Emblem doesn't have DS well, there's one DS Fire Emblem, but I played through that in like in like eight hours and it just it was too easy and quick and not very fun. But I played through Fire Emblem Sacred Stones and Radiant Dawn probably ten times each. I'm currently on whatever umpteenth time playthrough on my 3DS because I was part of the ambassador program for the idiots who bought the 3DS before the price drop. We got f like ten free Game Boy Advance games and ten free NES games and one of the Game Boy Advance games was Fire Emblem Sacred Stones. So, I'm working on that. 
for the like tenth time. And I've also and I own Radiant Dawn and I played Path of Radiance and I played Fire Emblem Seven, which was the first one released in America. And I also played a translated version of Fire Emblem Six, which was the first Game Boy version, but I played it on my computer because you can't get a Japanese game here and you can't get it in English. Um Oh, and Harry Potter. How could I forget Harry Potter? I love Harry Potter. I read all seven books through, like, seventh and eighth grade. Yes, I was late. Deal with it. Um, I saw all the movies, etc., etc. Um, oh, and I learned every single spell from Harry Potter while I was reading the books. Because I'm very... I'm a very facts kind of guy. I like to know all the facts, and I always remember specific facts about insignificant things in novels, like in The Hunger Games, I could tell you everything about every, um, tribute from each district, like, Foxface from District, Il no, okay, bad example, but when I have just finished a book, I can tell you, I can recite useless information. So, I'm just a fanboy. I do that for a lot of things. And... Uh, happy Fandom Week!